correct me if I'm wrong. Or, this is your first time to have a sci-fi. Second po, second. Yung first po sa isang hindi independent film festival, it's talaga yung title. So second po ito. Pero ito, hinaliwan ko ng romance. So why did you decide? Anong timeline ito? Present day? Unspecified siya, pero originally it was meant to be parang ano lang, malapit na future. Pero it's very timely kasi nakikita ko ngayon yung mga Apple Vision Pro, yung mga nakasuot na lang ano, mga VR glasses, yung mga tao sa daan. So parang yung timing tamang-tama na lalabas yung movie na rin. Why did you decide another sci-fi film project dito? Um, gusto ko lang ano. What brought about this project? Um, matagal na kasi ang gumagawa ng romance films dito po sa mainstream. So, parang gusto ko lang ng kakaibang putahe. So, since interesado naman ako sa sci-fi, so, tinry ko lang i-fuse yung dalawang genre na yan in hopes of offering something new sa mga tao. And then, you had the hand in choosing your cast? Yes po, always naman po. Oo. Can I ask them also, how to find, good afternoon, good afternoon, Jeg, how did you feel when this when this project was offered to you? This is your first time, all of you. Your first time to do sci-fi, na romance. Yes, that genre. Yes. How did I feel? Yes. I'm happy because. And how did you take this project? Uh, I took a flight back home from Australia. Just uh, ah, so you me. were in Australia. Yeah, we shot this a long time. Jerome was saying that like, he shot this before, like I don't know there how many other. We shot this like last year in June, June or July. Oh, alright. So after that, we had a lot of different projects, and um, it was great. I always love working with like JP. He always pulls a side out of me that. Hindi ko alam na nandiyan, so that's, I always commend him as a director for being able and capable of doing that. Uh, first time kumakatrabaho si the beautiful Jasmine Curtis, and it was a wonderful experience. And Jerome, uh, isa yan sa mga, ano, uh, one of the industry's best actors, so it's always a pleasure working with him. He also gave me a lot of tips about buying a house and stuff like that. Kuya ko to eh, Kuya Jerome ko to. So it's, it was a pleasure working with this whole ensemble. Alright, thanks. Can we hear from Jasmine and then Jerome? Hello. Hello po. Um, for me, I guess it's my first time to work with um, both Diego and the next JP, but um, I actually worked with Jerome a long, long time ago. But I didn't push up for TV or <laughs> We did like a Santa Cruz and together in a provincial town. Um, but ever since then, we'd always see each other sa mga events. So, um, nung nabanggit po na siya yung mga kasama ko, immediately, at least there was that familiarity with each other. And then same with Diego, we kind of run into the same circle. So, wala namang awkwardness or um, any hindrances there. Right away, there was um, ability para sa aming pareho na maging magkaroon ng connection kasi kami po yung mag-asawa dito we play husband and wife so um, yeah uh, and then as well as when I got the script as well it was it's also kind of yung modern tech na sci-fi po first time ko siyang ma-encounter in a script um, kasi in the past it was medyo neo world medyo end of the era na pa, you know it's like it's not this kind of refreshing type of feeling or um, or uh, with a nice type of different colorful lights and uh, it, it's just it feels younger and it feels fresher um, for me to, to play a role like this and to do a story like this so like uh, much like the JP I, I, I wanted to do something different for yeah I also be working on this First time is uh, uh, sci-fi. Um, yeah, actually, this is um. Uh, while shooting this, I don't know if you can see the impact of sci-fi. Actually, modern na matay na din dahil ng Apple Vision Pro, ganito to get um the VR, lahat kung ano yare. Um, so more on uh, 
maganda lang talaga sa situation na gusto kong i-spoil sana. Ang ganda nung pagka... Um, bale, nung the way na, alam niya, medyo yung future yes. of possible things. So, yun po. Um, first time, first time, yeah, for a sci-fi SVD. Uh, to make it clear lang po, it's ako, mas tinitignan ko siya as a love story with sci-fi elements. Hindi naman siya yung parang sci-fi na, na super specific sa technology or sa high-tech na mga bagay-bagay. It's a, it's a love story or a romance movie with sci-fi elements. Can I hear from the cast as well? Personally, if you will deal with it, will you go through sci-fi to solve your art problem? No. I have enough of them as it is. It's okay. <laughs> um, for me, no, it, it, Iba na kasi ang panahon ngayon na pumapasok yung virtual reality sa mundo natin. Medyo um, madali din talagang mahok, lalo na sa mga taong mag-isa or di kaya um, like, like the role of Jerome in this film may pinagdadaan ng social anxiety disorder. Ma nagiging comfort zone siya for a lot. So ako, alam ko, prone ako to, to relying on tech para ma-ease yung nararamdaman ko para ma-distract ma ma ako, para mawala mo na ako. Pero tingin ko, natatakot ako mag-rely sa isang virtual reality na talagang nag-respond ng with feelings. Kasi parang iba na yun. Iba po yung parang yung mga chat, GPT, yung mga ganyan. Iba pa yun eh. Parang uh, feel mo pa na robot pa rin talaga yan. So you will not? I don't think I would. It's too scary. <laughs> Same, same. Uh, hindi ako fan masyado ng, you know, um, too much uh, futuristic. Uh, it kills, um, you know, uh, jobs, kills uh, hobbies, sports, and everything. So, yeah. Thank you very much. That was Ms. Lea Sel. Hi, Josh. Uh, how's working? Um, is this uh, with... Um, Jagger, is this your first movie with him? First project? Yes, 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 yes. 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 So how's working with him? Is it uh pareho ko yung ano sa Australia, di ba? Australia. That's right. That's right, that's right. It's been it was easy. It was light lang. Actually with the both of them, you know, on the set that I it the the working set for us was nice because wala kang mararamdaman na drama or if there were any difficulties on the productions and hindi siya nakakaabot ang nakakarating. So, talagang for us actors, I believe, we, we were very, uh, ano naman, blessed with a good set and no drama with each other. So, yeah. Mm -hmm. So, uh, marami kayo na pagkukwentuhan. Uh, kasi parang kayo naman kayo sa Australia. Australia. Actually, napagkwentuhan mo. Parang not so much, no? Konti, konti. Because also, I'm very um, acquainted with his mom and his tita. So, pag nakikita ko sila sa mga events sa Australian Embassy, yun, si Jego, lagi kong nakikita doon sa Australian Embassy. So, um, yeah, yun. Mostly yun yung mga chika-chika namin if it's about Australia. Yeah. Pero siyempre, uh, kayo um, considered na uh, magaling na artista, no? So, na malaman mo makakatrabaho mo for the first time, si Jego, anong... Yeah. <laughs> well, of course, I'm always excited to work with new people because um, ang tagal mo na silang nakakakalubilo sa industriya or sa mga events, no? Pero um, hindi mo pa na experience yung exchange of energy sa rules or characters pag may kwento nyo. So, it's always um, exciting to discover that sa buong actors. Like Jego and, and Jerome as well. So. so how's working with Jerome? Is is this your first project possibly? Yes, in the film and and, and um and it's been it's been great. I think we the thing is kasi yung mga eksena namin dito ni Jerome sobrang limited din yung physical interaction in this in the way that um a lot of yung scenes namin medyo hiwalay. Chinute, 